Hi everybody, this is Bethunet Games, and today I'm going to be upgrading my tutorial on how to make projectiles destroy destructible meshes. So let's get started. Click on content, double click on ge geometry, double click on meshes, and right click on 1M cube. Click on to create destructible mesh, and let's put values in that just work or that I know just work for testing purposes so damage threshold at 1200 damage spread at zero enable impact damage and that's all you need for the basic so we'll fracture and then we'll save and then you can exit out of that window and then you'll have the destructible mesh cube in your content browser drag that into the scene and then just make sure it's sitting on the floor on the very top of it because if it's like halfway I'll just fall through have to re-enable physics I'll save it okay so after that's done over in the details window we will check uh, check simulate physics under physics check enable gravity which should be already checked um, under collision, we check on it. simulation generates hit events and change the collision presets to physics actor. Okay. Now we'll go to content again and double click on first person BP, double click on blueprints and open up first person projectile by double clicking on it also okay now the first place we want to go under components is collision component and we'll check simulate physics because we want both uh, both physics actors to react to each other naval gravity is already checked uh, check on simulation generates hit events and under collision presets click on physics actor that's important okay now go to sphere and check simulation generates hit events and change this to custom now we'll compile and save now we can X out of that. And if everything goes as planned, it should destroy the cube. Kaplow, there we go. Thank you for watching my updated tutorial on how to make projectiles destroy destructible meshes. Stay tuned for more tutorials. Thank you.